What is going on, Grinders? Chief Justice 06 here. We're back yet again. We're talking Monkey Knife Fight. Let's put a few more dollars in your pockets. Don't forget, get into the prop shop. A lot of good things are happening. Money's being made on a daily basis. We're going to hop into the San Diego Padres and the Miami Marlins. Not going with the two pick, going with the three pick. Let's see if we can get the four X for you today. Is it more? Is it less? Let's hop in and find out. So first up on the docket, we've got Pablo Lopez at five and a half strikeouts. And while Pablo has been fairly good at home, one of the things that I understand is he is going to struggle with lefties. There will be enough lefties in this lineup to give him a few problems. He's got a much lower K rate than lefties, sitting at around 21% versus 29% to righties. And, and when you look at him overall, just doesn't have the strikeout stuff to really dial up those big games. Uh, did, had four strikeouts against Atlanta, six strikeouts against the Cubs, one against the Mets, 11 against Cincinnati. So as you can see, with lower strikeout teams, he's just not going above that number. San Diego's definitely a lower strikeout team. Let's go over to Mike Clevenger at four and a half hits. I think we've got a little bit of value here. If it was five and a half, I probably would have stayed away. At four and a half, I think that the Miami Marlins, though a, a putrid offense overall, I think these guys have enough guys to get, get a few hits. Joey Wendell is definitely a hit candidate. Birdie is definitely a, a, a hit candidate. Rojas is a hit candidate. Now we just need a few of the others uh, to get us there right over the hump. I would definitely take the over. And then we're hopping down to Juan Soto, the big acquisition. Listen, folks, 11.2% K rate, 23.3% walk rate. 273 ISO, 418 Boba against right-handed pitching this season. Definitely think we get at least a hit and a walk or two walks in this scenario. Love Juan Soto here. And I think these three folks are giving us the combination for the big 4X over at Monkey Night Fight. We've been hanging out. We've been talking Monkey Night Fight. It's three pieces and a biscuit week, folks. I'll be right back here tomorrow for more Monkey Night Fight action.